For the first time in five weeks, beachgoers will be able to hit the sands in Panama City Beach on a limited basis. The City Council voting to reopen the city beaches in conjunction with Bay County. News 13's Kayla Tucker has that story. In their first day on the job, newly elected Mayor Mark Sheldon and Councilman Michael Jarman were faced with a tough decision to open the nine miles of beach in the city or not. Obviously a hot topic during our campaign season and for Michael and I both and I know uh, Councilman Chester dealt with it as well. After a short discussion, the council voted unanimously to open the sands during limited hours of the day. It's important for people to have outlets for uh, exercise and fresh air and sunshine. I am a little concerned with our surrounding states and our states not having any uh, decline in new cases. Uh, I'm, I'm a little concerned with Georgia still um, increasing. Outsiders flocking to the area is a concern, but they're ensuring the closed beach message is still being shared. The TDC is not going to be advertising for visitors to come down here by no means. They're actually going to be flying a banner plane twice a day up think twice a day and uh, just, you know, warning people and everything. So I assure you, they're not advertising and open up the floodgates for visitors to come down. While the beaches are only open for a limited time each day, Mayor Sheldon says they will be watching the virus even closer than before. That I want to make sure that we are watching it so the curve doesn't 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 grow on us. You know, but if it's level or down, then we can look at it. We got to look at you No, know, we have the best police department and fire department in the area and uh, they will be relied upon heavily to make sure that everything is going smooth. The opening will go into effect Friday morning at 6. In Panama City Beach, Kayla Tucker, News 13, Panhandle Strong.